Morning Survivalist one here. Today I'm going to do a uh, quick video about uh, trip wiring. Uh, this is used as a combat multiplier and uh, can be used to uh, guard your premises and know if somebody's entered and onto your property. Sorry if my voice is a little bit rough. I'm getting over a cold right now. Um, I got these two things at the dollar store. Uh, 15 glow sticks and a pack of four mouse traps. So I can set up four mouse traps and um, or I can set up 15 of these because you need just 15 glow sticks. I'll show you how this works in a second. <clears throat> what you're going to need to do is take off this little hook thing right here which I won't be able to do without getting my pliers out and then uh, you will Actually, no, you could just leave that, I guess. Now you're going to have to remove this thing, too, possibly. And this thing just slides off, I think. Or, it, or that's hooked on. So, you might have to just leave that on there. It'll be able to work with it on. And, yeah, usually I use a different kind of mouse trap, so that I've experimented before with for using for uh, airsoft wars and stuff like that. So, I will show you... Uh, get these set up and I'll show you how to do the next step. Alright, I'm back. I got this uh, little pin out here. And um, all I did was just bend it out with the pliers. Let's see. And then um, also for this project, you're going to need fishing wire. You use clear fishing wire. Uh, there's some sort of coated fishing wire or non coated fishing wire, something like that. It's like wax free or something so your line doesn't. Um, because somehow it doesn't tie or something but you can also use for this um, unwaxed dental floss that will also work too um, but I just wanted to use clear wire so you couldn't see it alright so now that you got this off here um, you're gonna want to I'm gonna leave this on here this little metal piece right here and I just took out one of my glow sticks I don't know where I put it it's somewhere around here um, but anyways, you're gonna, here, let me just get out another one for you since I can't seem to find this one. Oh, here it is, right beneath the trap. Um, you're gonna wanna use clear tape for this, uh, cause you're also gonna need to tape the fishing wire to another, uh, thing. You could also use, what I was gonna use was, uh, fish eyes, those little, like, swivel hook things that look like a question mark, kind of. And that will screw into the wood, kind of like this, and screw this into the wood there, so you could tie it to another piece, which you could use if you have them laying around. But this is just for um, demonstration purposes, so I'm just gonna do it with clear tape because this stuff's pretty strong. It's scotch packing tape. Uh, so let me finish setting this up, and I will get back to you. Learn to this one here. Um, so this is the trap all set up. You guys can't even see it set up because of the string I used. But I tied it to this log just temporarily. What I see that little screw right there. Um, I thought that was sticking out further, but it wasn't. It got stuck too far in the woods, so I wasn't able to tie it around there into the trap. So I just wrapped it around the log just for demonstrative purposes. And then over there. I tied it up to the boat and as you can see that trigger right there is ready to go like is, that thing is see how the, tight the wire is on it as soon as something touches that like a twig would probably be able to set it off all I have is a little log here which is very light because it's just a sliver of wood. But here I'm going to throw it at the trap and see if it goes off. Hold on, let me switch the camera to my other hand. I'd walk through it, but you guys wouldn't be able to really see it. Ready? So as you see, that just set that trap off. As you can see, it's already starting to glow. See, that's where it's clear, and that's where it cracked the trap. 
and then I put some sticks behind it so um, you wouldn't be able to see it from the other side but yep um, I forget is that just so you know comment multiplier so you give away that you might have something valuable making people want to attack you or something but if I'm up in my window looking down and just guarding and this is my post watching this comment multiplier to make sure nothing happens um, and this thing goes off yeah they might know that I have valuable resources but I'll be able to take them out before they can do anything also the uh, thing actually did break the glow stick in case if any of you are wondering this is pretty dark in there but you can see that it's glowing inside of there and also um, just another thing is when these things go off you know what a mouse trap sounds like I assume let me, let me get this down here like a mouse trap going off sounds like here I don't want to check my camera but just like this I mean that, it's pretty loud so if you want you could if you could have a um, like a bigger space between your trap and that whole span of wire like you will people will know what the hell happened and they just will think oh yeah well no big deal like maybe somebody stepping on a twig or something so if you have this about maybe like 10 feet away from your actual spot that you're trying to guard and people just walk through the trap this thing is so sensitive you see it, um, that when they actually do touch it and that thing goes off you're not gonna have to worry about people like uh, or you're not gonna have to worry about um, having to uh, and not go off or whatever it just goes off right away and breaks your glow stick from maybe 15 extra feet away so they don't know what that noise was and they don't really know um, where they're what they just set off but you could um, also another thing is uh, instead of putting it at like feet level put it if you, I heard that uh, if you put it at waist level that um, when they walk they usually people either walk look up straight ahead of them or when they're walking they look at the ground so if you put it at waist height that's not where they're looking and they're gonna hit it but that spot I showed you in the other video was just uh, or the in the beginning of this video or middle of the video whatever you want to call it um, is the only spot I had to set this up and for quick demonstration purposes but yeah that's all I think for this video uh, no survivalist one, I'm out.